Welcome to Richardson RFPD's 2020 virtual IMS demo on analog devices new DC to 6 gigahertz Raspberry Pi signal generator. Our two presenters today are Brandon Bushy, System Solutions Engineering Manager, and Robert Danderar, Product Marketing Manager with the High Speed Converter Group, both with analog devices. The CN0511 is a single tone signal generator with an output frequency range from DC up to 6 GHz. It is controlled using a Raspberry Pi and plugs directly into the 40 pin expansion header for easy connectivity. Having a look at the system block diagram, the core of the design is made up of the AD9166 high speed digital to analog converter and the ADF4372 16 GHz PLL with integrated VCO. We'll take a closer look at the DAC details in a few moments. There is also an extensive power tree designed to provide the best performance to the sensitive RF devices while properly sequencing them on and off and only requiring a single power connection which originates from the Raspberry Pi. Going beyond hardware, Analog Devices develops and maintains a Linux distribution called Kuiper Linux, which is based off the standard Raspbian distribution but with the ADI tools and features pre-installed. Using Kuiper Linux with the CN0511 device tree overlay, the Raspberry Pi will be able to interface and control the signal generator without additional software or setup time. So let's begin with an overview of the 89166 block diagram. So this 9166 combines the Merriam DAC with a wide band by CMOS amplifier in a system in package. The integrated amplifier provides a clean DC coupled single ended 50 ohm output and extends the performance of the DAC by eliminating the need for AC coupling caps and costly balance. For the instrumentation market, which consists of 5G testers, signal generators, and oscilloscopes, the 89166 offers a, a wide band signal generator on a chip with output power flatness beyond 6 GHz. For radar and electronic warfare applications, the 89166 offers a direct L and S band digitizer or an LO for CX band radar and electronic warfare applications where fast frequency hopping and low latency is critical. Let's now discuss some of the performance specifications and features of the 89166. So to begin, the spurious free dynamic range at 6 giga sample per second is minus 75 dBc at 550 MHz. The error vector magnitude is minus 52 dB at 2.4 gig. The NSD or noise spectral density is minus 151 dBc per hertz at 1990 megahertz. And the power consumption is just under five watts at five gigasample per second. Let's have a closer look at the board, demo setup, and run a few tests. Here's the top side of the CN0511 hardware, which contains the majority of the components. The 809166 is the metallic device in the center of the board, and its clock is being driven by the ADF4372 PLL plus VCO. The reference clock into the ADF4372 is provided by an onboard crystal oscillator, making it really easy to use. You can also provide the reference clock via the SMA cable here if you require a cleaner source. The power sequencer monitors the DAC and PLL voltage rails so they come up and down in the correct order, protecting them. Setting up the system is really simple. Insert a pre-configured microSD card, connect the two boards together, connect a USB keyboard and mouse, and plug in the power. Now let's run two tests using the CN0511. First, we are going to open the software and set the output frequency to 1 GHz. Coming over to the analyzer, you can see the output tone is now at 1 GB. Let's go back to the Raspberry Pi and change the output to 5 GHz in the software. Moving back to the analyzer, you can see the updated spectrum and the new peak is now at 5 GHz, just as we had expected. Next, let's do a phase noise plot at 1 GHz 
which sweeps from 10 hertz all the way out to 1 megahertz. As the analyzer plots the data, you see the phase noise at 1 kilohertz is around minus 120 dBc and stays relatively flat out to about 100 kilohertz where it peaks slightly before attenuating. We hope that you've enjoyed this demo. If you would like to learn more, please visit us at richardsonrfpd.com slash analog devices.